My name is Paul Belanger. I'm the technical product manager for DNM Holdings. Uh, today we have our new and upcoming AVR 4520CI. It is a 9.2 channel receiver, 150 watts per channel, um, with 11.2 channel processing capability if you want to add a stereo power amplifier for those extra two channels. Um, this is our first product with full 11.2 channel DTS Neo X capability. Uh, also, we've got Odyssey Multi-Q XT32 on board with Sub-EQ HT for dual subwoofer calibration. We're also using a new Odyssey technology called Odyssey LFC, or Low Frequency Containment, which will prevent subwoofer noise from leaving your room and disturbing your neighbors. Um, on the back panel of this guy, we've got a few new features. Uh, number one is going to be our four-port Ethernet switch, uh, one in for your inter internet connection, three out to the other components that you might have in your rack to get them an inter internet feed. As well, uh, new for this year with, with Den and Morant's receivers, we've got a dedicated uh, multi-zone HDMI output or a matrix output allowing you to watch two different programs on two different TVs at the same time. Uh, this particular unit happens to have three HDMI monitor outputs, uh, dual simultaneous, the matrix out, plus a dedicated zone two component video output, uh, giving you the ability to actually have three video zones. Flip down door, uh, uh, dedicated HDMI input on the front, as well as a uh, iPod, iPad, iPhone, uh, USB connector for true digital connection from your iOS device or thumb drive. Uh, fully DLNA 1.5 compliant. Uh, Pandora, Sirius XM, VTuner, Internet Radio, AirPlay, and Spotify shipping in this unit for the first time with us as well.